Okay, so before we get started with this video, it is not sponsored by Champion, but Champion, if you're listening, I'm here. But let's talk about Bodies, Bodies, Bodies. This is A24's latest horror film that is coming out at the end of the summer. And this is coming at a release date in August. And A24 has just been trying to bring the slasher genre all on themselves, right? Like they've given us X already this year and Bodies, Bodies, Bodies continues to do that. So when I first heard about this movie, I was very interested, especially hearing that he got rave reviews of South by Southwest. So I went ahead and looked more into it and we have a synopsis out there already. So I'm going to go ahead and read that tell you my thoughts on it and what i think about this movie so let's get in with it bodies 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 i'm reading the synopsis right here a group of seven young friends have a house party at a remote mansion during a hurricane i think that's very interesting especially i don't think we've had an, enough hurricane horror movies right out there so it says hosted by their childhood hosted by their childhood best friend sophie who is recently sober and david who ex is excessively wealthy i believe david's going to be played by pete davidson so a24 is really playing that card right there so we'll see how that one plays out b is the working class girlfriend of sophie and new to their friend group she is naive to the kind of party they host and needs a large amount of cake without realizing it is an edible so pretty much we know where this one's going right one of the guests, Jordan, also warns B that Sophie is not who she seems. Sophie, having been in rehab, has not spoken to the others in the group for some time, and social dynamics are awkward between them. The group decides to play party games, choosing Bodies, 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 a murder-in-the-dark style game. Murder mystery? Who knows? The game goes poorly and fractures the friendships even more, with David arguing with everyone from his boring girlfriend Emma to another outsider in the group, the much older Greg, they end the game but soon find a real murder has taken place and have to again search for the murderer among them. So pretty much it sounds like this movie is really going to be a comedy drama already from what we've seen and mixing some horror and stuff on there as well. That's how it's pretty much um, said to be as well, a comedy drama but with some horror in there. It currently has a 95% on Rotten Tomatoes, so a pretty high score for a movie that is in the horror genre. Usually horror movies get a little bit of like bad reviews here and there, but this one's already getting some pretty good rave reviews from the beginning, and it's reminded me of X as well, so very excited about that. And so what I meant when I said that Pete Davidson being in this, it's sort of also giving me the vibes that he is that guest big name they want to have that's not so big of a name but it's also a pretty popular name as well and we see horror movies do this all the time so i think that's going to definitely draw some appeal right there i do think that a24 is pretty much having a good year as well with x and this is definitely going to pick up that hype that x already had into the summer as well as we get into a horror movie in the summer it usually is a clear indication it's a success because studios won't necessarily put a horror movie in the summer slots they're more expensive if they don't think they already have a hit so i'm pretty sure this is going to be insane so the soundtrack is also made by disaster piece who went on to make the it follow soundtrack which is one of the best soundtracks so any indication of that soundtrack you know what type of movie feel we're about to get and i'm definitely going to make a video about it follows and the soundtrack because i believe the music in that movie really made it even much more better so that's why i'm more excited about bodies 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 because i think that the right music and everything is just going to be a an amazing movie so like i said i think the slasher genre is really having a revitalization now currently i think that scream really was that like, movie that really is pushing the genre further now and now we've got other movies this year coming out as well one of the biggest ones of course is halloween but we just recently got x so i'm definitely excited to see how bodies 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 fits into all of this as well and very excited for these more like fun lax type of horror movies and up until the recent like five years we've been getting a lot of as scream says the elevated horror so it's pretty refreshing to see a lot of these horror movies that sound like they're just trying to have some sort of fun with it all coming out but still being good movies as well with good scores uh critically acclaimed some of them as well so i'm excited for what the future holds for these horror movies and bodies 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 as well so definitely let me know your thoughts and opinions on it as well but as always that is going to do it for me if you haven't already subscribed to the channel go ahead and subscribe hit that notification bell so you know when these videos drop let me know your thoughts and opinions on the movie and if you're excited to check it out or not but like i said everything seems to be going right with this movie from the soundtrack the director seems pretty good as well 
But let me know your thoughts and opinions on this movie if you're excited or not. I was immediately hooked after hearing about Disaster Piece being attached to this because I thought they did such a great job with It Follows. It Follows, I think, still ranks among the top movies of the horror genre in the last 20 years. And I'm definitely excited to see how this soundtrack sounds. I still listen to that soundtrack for It Follows just by itself. I still think it's one of the best made. Heels is a top track and definitely one of the best opening shots for any horror film was It Follows. Check it out on YouTube if you haven't already. I think it was great, the style and everything as well. So I'm excited to know that same style of music is going to be here in this movie. And I'm definitely excited to check out what exactly they bring to the table with this. If it's gotten rave reviews at South by Southwest, they're calling it bizarre. And all of these good things, I'm definitely hooked and checking it out. So let me know what you think. I'm going to be watching it in theaters as soon as it comes out. But if you are loving my channel, everything I talk about from horror to TV shows, movies, and all of that, don't forget to subscribe on the road to 21,000 subscribers. So definitely appreciate everybody subscribing less than 600 away. So super pumped to get to that goal. And make sure that you hit that notification bell either here or over here. YouTube likes to be funny about things, so they sometimes won't notify you about videos unless notifications are on. And also follow me on Twitter. I'll leave it somewhere here, as well as TikTok, all that good stuff to know when I drop other videos as well. Drop different things here and there, but as always, that is going to do. I'll see all of you next time. Stay safe, stay positive. Also, let me know if there's anything you want me to cover, such as a TV show or movie and stuff. I usually like to look at the comments and things people request. There's always a ton of stuff that we miss, especially in today's age with so much things that we have to watch that sometimes we miss things. And I always like when people recommend things, so go ahead and comment them below. Now, what is your favorite horror movie you're looking forward to this year, whether it's a movie that already came out or a movie that hasn't come out? Let me know what movie you are looking forward to. I definitely was excited for Scream, but now it's definitely Evil Dead Rise. Hey, if you're still listening, I appreciate you checking out this video all the way to the end. Make sure if you haven't already checked out the video on the left, make sure that you are subscribed as well. We are definitely going to be dropping a ton more videos throughout the week and year and all of that. And together we can grow this page all the way to where we want to grow it to. And that's just the community of people that love to talk about pop culture and all the good stuff around it. So make sure you're following, subscribing, notification bell on, all that good stuff. Stay safe, stay positive, my friends.